Hey everybody, listen, I am so, so sorry about the way that video ended. Um, not enough storage on my damn phone, so everything just went to shit. But I just wanted to make sure that you had the last part of this video. So that's why this video is going to be very short and sweet. Um, it'll be in the comment section to click on to that to see the way that reading ended. So when we finished off, this person's actual uh, card was guilt. I release any beliefs that no longer assist in my soul's growth meaning they need to release all the toxic things that they've been doing in their life it's not assisting in their soul's growth it will allow them to release the guilt that they feel of the way that they treated you because they are very guilty about it however they have to change who they are they got to change they have to look within they have to look at their purpose they have to look at what they're here to do on this earth they really have to look at the way that they move in life because it's something about not having enough honor not having trust not having not being someone that someone can rely on and it's, it's it's really giving them a lot of guilt okay but in order for them to release that they got to change their their growth they have to grow there's nothing else they can do death was here for you though um, I am learning that endings are merely beginnings you guys are on two totally different wavelengths in the same realm of growth but for you you are no longer investing in things that you don't believe in investing in things that no longer serve your highest good so it's almost like your belief system has changed um you allow things to die you allow things to move on you're not holding on to that energy anymore you've let that shit go okay um i'm gonna pull one more card and then i'm gonna get out of here okay i am so sorry about the way that um ended but i just didn't feel right posting it and then it just cut off the way it did so usually i don't do this but you guys understand patience is here have patience this person needs to have patience with your soul's growth have patience with the way that you are moving in life now yourself have patience with your own growth have patience with the belief system that you're creating for yourself it's almost like you're your own self guru right now you are believing in the things that serve you like you're you're watching your manifestations come to play you're watching everything change in your life have patience though okay i accept that everything happens in divine order know that the universe has your back okay the universe has your back a thousand percent hundred grand they got you okay so denial here and I, it's weird because you both are pulling you know what i mean denial for this person serious denial and thinking that you would come back after the way that they treated you. They really have to let that shit go. They really need to focus on themselves and heal themselves from within because you are just not, you're not here to be played with. You're not here to play with my heart. Like that's that's not what you're here for. You're a divine one. And this person needs to respect that, okay? Denial, I acknowledge my fear, but I replace it with the insight of awareness. And when I see that word fear, it just reminds me that this person has very low self-esteem. The fear of being alone, the fear of missing out, the fear of not, of, of not, getting to something and what they really need to look at is why what the hell are you so worried about what are you so fearful of if you are alone what's going to happen what what's the worst that could happen to you if you are you know so it's it's a lot going on with this person they have a lot of emotional turmoil that they have to really dig into and it's going to be up to you if you even want to go towards that but right now i don't see that happening for you i see you going towards yourself going towards your purpose, going towards the light, going towards the things that serve you in this life, in this lifetime, okay? And because it, let me tell you, because it brings you balance, baby. You balance as hell right now. This person is off balance. You are completely balanced. I bring a state of perfect harmony into my world and I do so without judgment. Your energy is beautiful. This person can't taint it anymore like they used to. They can't even affect your happiness like they used to. You are owning all of that shit. Like you are owning everything about yourself. And I'm really proud of the way that your cards have been coming out lately. I love all of you. You know what I mean? But it's just the growth that you've had. It's amazing. It's inspiring. It's inspiring others. It makes me get my ass up here and pull cards for you. That's how inspiring you are. Like keep moving forward. Don't let anything stop you. Know that the universe has you and know that you done been through worse. What's this? You know what I mean? So keep moving forward and acknowledge that in yourself. Acknowledge how strong you are. Acknowledge the growth that you've had. Acknowledge the fact that your beliefs have changed. Acknowledge that you're more spiritual. Acknowledge that you're inspiring others. Okay? All right, guys. I'm going to end it here. <laughs> this uh, part two, I guess, will be in the comments. 
so you can click on it um, and when you see it if you see it on my channel it will look like a video that's like five minutes long so you're gonna be like what the hell is this but it is the continuation of the video that cut off all right all right guys thank you so so very much for hanging out with me I truly truly appreciate all of you don't forget to like share and subscribe and I'll see you guys on the next one thanks bye